Hey there, people! My name is Tagori, and welcome back to another episode of Legend of Dragoon. In the last episode, we covered a lot of story. There was a lot of cutscenes. Um, Rose and Meru joined us, and we learned that we need to fight the Divine Dragon. And the thing is, we need to talk to the Winglies that should reside in this forest. Um, to get their Dragon Block Staff. So where are they? Um, I'm assuming... Gosh, I'm saying I'm a lot. I'm assuming they're gonna be to the right, where we first met Kamui. So I'm still sick, which hopefully is okay. Oh, I can go through here. dead end. Here we are at the entrance to the Forest of the Winglies. <sighs> Maybe I'll be kicked out again. Where's the entrance? I see nothing. There's a magical boundary here. Winglies have locked themselves in the forest since the dragon campaign. How come they didn't live with humans? You know about the dragon campaign? It's the war that humans who obtained the power of Dragoons started in order to liberate themselves from control of the Winglies. Some Winglies are still angry about that. Besides, Winglies have a power that humans don't have. The Ancestor told me that the power draws a line between humans and us. Meru, are you? Yep, I'm a Wingly. Are you surprised? Yeah. Why didn't you tell us? Would you believe me? Would you consider me as a friend if I told you guys? It doesn't matter. Meru is Meru, right? Aw, oh, that's perfect with the music. Now, let's go see the Winglies. Now we are dealing with serious stuff. I wonder what would happen to us if the Divine Dragon came to this forest. We'd fight it with our magic, but probably we would fail given our current level of power. But the Ancestor said that we won't be become extinct if we cooperate with other species. Other species? Are you talking about humans? That's right, but I wonder if everybody in the forest can understand that, including me. The seal. Meru. The humans. Meru brought humans here. I'm going to let the ancestor know. Don't shoot. They're my friends. Yeah, because that'll help. We're not here to fight. We're here to borrow the dragon block staff. The Dragon Block Staff. Meru, how dare you speak about our secrets to them? But the Divine Dragon is now awake! But what can humans do if they can't even use magic? Should we break through? No, we should not. We have to take some action or everything may be destroyed. That includes the Forest of the Winglies and human cities. Everyone, hold on. Ancestor says he will meet with the humans. You, please don't agitate the people in the forest. We're not used to seeing humans. But, watch out for the Bardo brothers. What do you mean? 
Let's go, Dart. The ancestor Blanu is on the back of this forest. Interesting. That was what I was saying. I'm still sick. So if you see pauses, it's probably me coughing. Um, probably best not to talk to anyone. Right. I guess I have to talk to you. It's an order of the ancestor. I'll carry you to the back. All right. Walls between species are thicker than you would think, but maybe you can destroy them. I feel that way. Um, do you say that to every human you see? Just go out the door. Because I feel like you don't see a lot of humans. What are these? Teleporters, probably. Who are you? Ah, you're the ancestor. Without using the stone, your humans cannot use magic or fly. Humans are such weaklings. Maybe you weren't? What is this? I'm gonna just check what this is. What the hell? What the crap? I'm assuming these take us somewhere. Hopefully it's where I need to go. Um, sure. Let's just take us up. You look like the weapons. The item. Oh. Still, I'm gonna check. That guy had nothing. And you're the weapon seller. Perfect. I am going to check this one out. All they had really was an item for Meru. Weapon. Um, what? Let me show you some cool stuff! Ooh. What is that? What is this? Yeah, that's what I want to know. It's the Archangel. It's the guardian god of the Winglies. The ancestor told me. You say told me, but you don't worship it too, Meru. I don't know. I've never been protected. Maybe I just don't know, though. Okay, end of tour. Interesting. <clears throat> More teleporters! Meru, I knew it. You're coming back to me. Oh. You're humans. So, you're the friends of Meru. That's right. This is Guahara, a friend of mine. Friend zoned. You just said I'm your friend? Um, we grew up together. You're my fiance. What? I didn't know you had a fiance, Meru. Hmm. There's more to you than I thought, Meru. Wow, what are you talking about? It's true, isn't it? I thought she was still a kid. <laughs> it must be true that the Wingleys have a long life, and they are not as young as they look. What are you analyzing me for? What kind of relationship do you have with Meru? Relationship? We're just friends. At first, she insisted on following us. Is that so? We have no time to talk about that! Gwahara! Why are you cooping yourself up in here? There are awful things going on outside! As the ancestor told us, the divine dragon has come back to life, hasn't it? Why are you defend why aren't you defending the forest? The other day, I let you in the forest, Meru. I'm prob I'm on probation now. 
course, I would defend the forest if I could. Whatever! Voices are destroying my voice. We're going to see the Ancestor. You just stay here and be gloomy. Mary, you have changed. You can be changed too if you go outside, Gohara. I, there is a commandment for us Winglies. We cannot do what you want to want us to do, Meru. Yes, you can. <laughs> Interesting. God, that sound is annoying. So much teleportation. Let's go on this one. Hey yo. What do you gotta say? The river stairs is for recovering your health. Please feel free to use it. It's an order from the ancestor. Okay. First, what is this? Ah, more stardust. Um, does that mean that it's only? Because I feel. Oh, Bardo, are you bothering us again? The divine dragon cannot can be taken care of by us without asking humans for help. Besides, we have no business talking to a betrayer who ran off to humans. What happened to you? The Bartle I knew was much kinder, and it wasn't like that. My baby sister was killed by a human. Oh no. My baby sister was influenced by you, Meru, and left the forest, believing that the outside world was wonderful. We don't need humans' help. Do you have something else to say? Get out. There might be more people killed now. Good for you. It's a good chance to learn how helpless you humans are. But we Winglies won't die. Our magic power surpasses the dragons. You are strong, huh? Don't make me laugh. I wonder if you have noticed you are declining because you cling to the glory of the past. What are you talking about? You can barely fly, and that's about it, right? Maybe you won't think that way after this. Hey, yo! No way. Is this the legendary Dragoon? Please, let us take care of the Divine Dragon. I'll come back to take care of your baby sister's matter after my journey has ended. So please trust us for now. The ones who flaunt their power disappear when the truly powerful appear. I'm going ahead. If we cannot even have revenge for our baby sister anymore, the divine dragon cannot be... I feel weak in my knees. I cannot move. Is this real? Ah! You wimp, brother. How dare you, humans. Just because you are afraid of our magic power, you're sending the destroyers of old dragoons at us. Silly humans. I'll pass sentence for the sin of killing my sister. I'll annihilate them now. We're almost there. Are you, are you gonna? Yep. You're gonna carry us. Please carry me. I am weak and cannot fly unless I am in battle. There's nobody here. Where's the ancestor? Body's being healed. Is this the magical healing? I 
wonder if it's an apology for the discourtesy. Ancestor, sorry we're late. Because everyone can teleport. Welcome, humans and giganto. I am Blano, the ancestor of the forest. I am the first sacred sister of Mil Sesu, Miranda. Please forgive our sudden visit. I would like you to listen to our story. The Divine Dragon is, I know. Oh, was that necessary? Really, dude? The Divine Dragon came back to life in the Mountain of the Immortal Dragon. And there are dragoons that have come to us. It seems the times won't leave us alone. <clears throat> the messenger from the Crystal Palace and the people who are fated to come here. Our opponent is so enormous. We have to combine each of our strengths or none of us will survive. Neither the Crystal Palace nor our forest. You mean... Let us put the power of the Dragoons and our wisdom together. You will let us borrow the Dragon Block Staff. We don't have the Dragon Buster now, so the Dragon Block Staff is our last resort. We no longer have the power to master that, however. If you, who rule the Dragons, can use it, we can fight against the Divine Dragon. I appreciate your kindness. However, we cannot participate in the battle. We are all that remain. We cannot become extinct. I'm going. I know. You're a dragoon too, Meru. <laughs> Go inside. I will show you the way to the dragon block staff. I'll meet you there, Meru. And then they just get squished. You are attracted to those humans. Yep. They're really cool, Ancestor. I want to go on the journey with them. And I want to see my mother and father anytime I want. Are you telling me to throw our commandment away? <laughs> it's not the right time yet. But eventually, in the near future... The time will come when us humans live together. Us and humans. Go with them. As a wingly. Go see humans. Or better yet, the entire world. Your experience will lead us. Okay. I hear ya. I'll meet you there. Hmm. Interesting elevator. If Meru is the one leading us to the other outer world... Where are those humans leading the world to? It must be the flow of time. Only the fates can tell. Interesting. So that must be down. Who are you? Dragon Block Staff is sealed in the Forbidden Land over there. Forbidden Land is the place where a hideous memory sleeps. It used to be, until 11,000 years ago, a place for us winglies, and it was the place where eternal prosperity was promised. It was called the royal capital, Cassetta. Now, it is a mere ruin without a name. Are you sure? Is it okay to go in? It is fine. Everything is in the past. Well, that could be more metaphoric, or it could be more literal. I see. We have to do what we can now. Are you ready? Not quite yet. What's wrong? We don't know when the Divine Dragon will come. I feel some monster over there. There's still some magic power left that attracts monsters. It won't be an easy road to the Dragon Block Staff. When you are ready, come to me. I'll lead you to the Forbidden Land. I say we're not ready yet, because we'll handle that in the next episode. <sighs> so, I hope you enjoyed this, and please, join me again for more Legend of Dragoon.